Alrighty. 14, 40, 14, 40. 14.29 p.m. Sunday afternoon. Book review. Hardcover edition for Brutal, the artist Sam Wise. Introduction by Chris. Conversation with Mickey. So there's the front, there is the back, and there is your synopsis. So this is a 303 page book. Pop on that TV so you can enjoy this awesomeness. Now, I did not know this book existed. I didn't even know who the fuck Sam was. There's your table of contents. A, B, C, D, E, F. <laughs> so, he has done art for many things. His style is pretty fucking dope. I love it. Like, I genuinely really love his fucking style. I am very tempted to buy this book, too. <laughs> very, very tempted to buy this book. There we go. His mood setting, his lighting, his color choices, beautiful. I like that husky warrior. Mm -mm -mm. Look at that belly. Belly. Mm. Sexy. Lots of gorgeous spreads in this book as well. He has done album work for bands. He has done some very great fucking work. Love it. And everything is labeled at the bottom of the page with uh, the type of image it is and the year. And the title and whatnot of the book is there. Page numbers in the corner. Just an FYI. <clears throat> that didn't sound good. <laughs> But yeah, I just, I, overall, this is one of them books that I really, really, really want to buy. I mean, it's just that beautiful. <laughs> Come on, don't get stuff together. He's got some beautiful grayscale in here. I see where just some noob got his inspiration for grayscale from. Definitely. Oh, what? Dude, grayscale is one of those types of arts that I feel doesn't get enough credit. Black and white's beautiful as well. Everybody loves fucking uh, black and white work because that's basically pencils and ink but you have people who will literally draw shit from pencils and pen and it turns out wonderfully beautiful tiger so you can see this art book is a mixed match of all of his stuff that he's done in different styles from short stuff to two page spreads lots of titties that surprise is like, damn, look at this bitch. Look at that. It's a titty monster. And we got Hulk Hogan in another universe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. Man, I do love the way he works. Like, the way he's put shit out in the tree. It's really beautiful. Sepia tone. I forget that color. But, yeah, it's the way he's done everything. 
can't get enough of it. <laughs> I was surprised he did so much stuff for um, artists, D and D, Warcraft. Just it's spellbinding, honestly. And of course you get a little paragraph on the opposite page, you know, talking about how he got into it. But yeah, this shit here, a lot of this would make great wallpapers, easily. At least this is an easy go-through book. It's not difficult. Like most books I've done, where it's like, I gotta go pick by pick. This is just like, turn, turn, turn. <laughs> but yeah. That's fucking cool. Stop. <clears throat> I don't wish I did the slideshow for this, but no oh well. I'm on a wrath. I used to listen to them, but then I got tired of them. It happens. I don't like a lot of art, a, metal, a lot of metal artists, to be honest. I'm picky like that. Oh, and the pages, they're really silky, by the way. In case you were wondering. Like, to get that silk texture to it, it makes them easy to turn. Sometimes. <laughs> This motherfucker, he looks so dope. There's so many dope pictures in this. Oh, so much dopeness in all of it. Yeah, this shit I love. This this is my scale of art that I like. That close up shit with the full detailing, that's really impressive shit. Cause that's mostly the ones that are done on um eleven by fourteen or eight by ten sketch paper. And those always turn out so beautifully. Yeah, Sam's work. Definitely way my top ten upper echelon of artists now. I think I need to follow his ass on Twitter, see what he puts out. I like this. That's beautiful. It goes from that gray tone to a very warm cherry. I like that. Or I should say Robitussin cherry. <laughs> Nasty ass Robitussin. Yeah. Yeah.
this was really cool. That reminds me of Naked Lunch. Yeah, that movie. <laughs> He's definitely outside of the box with his work. I like that. Warcraft. This is an epic two pager. Shit. The icons. I do like his John Hancock too. That shit is beautiful. Like that is a beautiful John Hancock right in the corner. So if you don't like Samwise, for whatever goddamn reason might possess you, <laughs> this book ain't for you. If you happen to like Samwise, definitely get this book, for sure. Like, any aspiring artist would enjoy this shit. Or if you just like art in general and you want to broaden your horizon and categories, Definitely grab him up. He's worth it. You get different mediums to check out with him. Oh, that's cute. Shit. Fucking radical. Two more. This one I really, really like. And that'll do it for the sirens. This one's another good one because this really brings in the scale. Yeah, fucking sirens ruining my day. Whatever. <laughs> Bitch. I was pretty surprised. Like, he really goes all out with a piece, and I like that a lot. I mean, he doesn't fuck around at all. Like, he really puts his heart and soul into his work, and it shows. Hearthstone. I've done some Hearthstone stuff, actually. I recently did Year of the Mammoth. And check out that book. That was pretty fun. I really like that. My kind of art book where it's just art, no text. This is one of those that has art, no text, which is good. A 
We're almost done. Look at the liquid. Oh, I love that. Amazing. I mean, his atmosphere style really sets him apart from everybody else easily. Oh boy. Heavy Rescue 4. So yeah, this is a very simple book to go through. She's pretty. Heroes of the Storm. Oh, everything's labeled too. Just an FYI. I forgot to mention that little tidbit. <laughs> yeah. God, I fucking love grayscale. Shit is so addictive. So I hope you enjoyed this as much as I did, because I really, this book really surprised me. Because I had no idea what to expect. But when I finished it, I was very, very happy. And I'm still happy we're going through this again. Like, woo. Yeah, it looks like Angela. And then you have your conversation with Mickey. There's some art here and there. His keyboard, very dirty. All this came out in 2020, my bad. <laughs> my bad. And this, he breaks down the cover step by step as well. Totally forgot to mention the damn year. I get so sidetracked because I want to get the shit done and post it. That way, there's less bullshit, you know? And we're done. Oops. Green back, hard cover. Let me show you the full setup. There you go. Of course, this is tape, so I can't take that off. But there you go. That was brutal. <laughs> it's fun. So sorry about the siren. Shit happens. So till next time, like and subscribe for thoughts and prayers.